Okay, let's just calm down. Calm down! Oh, you think I don't tell myself that on a daily basis? No, I don't. <laughs> Rise up! As Charlie said that would be Manson. He said one thing, right, Rise? Now, what I really want, well, what I want is more of everything, always. What I really want is a sacred space, a secret place, a magical, non-tragic existence where words and music flow like the blood of a matador gourd by the most beautiful bull that the world has never taken the time to witness. What I want, really all I want, is uninterrupted, hedonistic bliss before the final kiss, which will probably come up for most of you too fucking soon anyway, but I mean, I'm 60, I'm still alive, I ain't going nowhere, that's true. What I want, and what I do get, I'm insistent on this, is pure intoxication as I lose my mind. So I don't have to think about the insanity of men who would rather murder somebody else than to imagine me fucking and having a good goddamn time, and I will fucking have a good goddamn time. What I want is for you to be free. What I want is for everybody else to be more like me, to be free of misery and bullshit and agony and self-doubt, to be laughing like a lunatic, both middle fingers, flying in the face of fuckers who matter or not, and if all this is just too damn hard, then please just leave the fuck now. Thank you very much. Can we write it? Of course not going to. Why would you be too embarrassed? Hi, I'm Lydia Lange. All right. This is for the ghosts. It's for the ghosts, it's for the dead and dying, it's for the war torn and battle fatigued, it's for the widows and orphans of warriors, it's for the warriors, it's for the warriors who are willing to die fighting for their belief, who are willing to die fighting for what they believed in because they felt it was better to die fighting for freedom than to live a life enslaved by lies. And this is for those who believe. And you better believe. You better believe in ghosts. You better believe in ghosts because you too will soon enough become a ghost. This is for the ghosts of Fallujah, Anbar Province, Abu Ghraib, Bakuba, Guantanamo, Gaza, Beirut, Baghdad, Kabul, Kandahar, Jalalabad, Islamabad, Kathmandu, Mogadishu, Darfur, Sierra Leone, Yemen, all of Syria, Libya, Jordan, Gaza, all ghosts made by American intervention. It's for the freedom fighters. It's for the freedom fighters. It's for the insurgents. It's for the rebels and rabble rousers and for every individual who fights against tyranny and oppression. It's for the martyrs. It's for the martyrs from Mohamed Mossadegh, Salvador Allende, Oscar Romero, Teo Vango, Federico Garcia Lorca, Pasolini, Bruno Schultz, Madeline Marie O'Hare, one of my favorites. And if you are American, you better know about her. I suggest the 1969 Playboy interview with her. She is a woman who was singularly the most hated woman in America before I came along, got rid of prayer in school. Madeline Marie O'Hare. It's for the wounded. It's for the wounded and traumatized. It's for the survivors. This is for those suffering from post-traumatic stress syndrome, which I feel like I am suffering from every day of my goddamn life. This is for those that choose to survive and strive to overcome the roadblocks and landmines, the pitfalls and setbacks, the negativity of a world which forces you to fight tooth and nail, forces you into battle mode on a daily basis just so you can maintain a tenuous grip on your own sanity after a lifetime of the enemy's bullshit, torture, humiliation, brainwashing, and abuse. It's for the ghosts of Brooklyn, the Bronx, Philadelphia, Detroit, Watts, Englewood, Oakland, St. Louis, New Orleans, Memphis, Trenton, Youngstown, Cleveland, Camden, Baltimore, Newark, Little Rock, Tulsa, Baton Rouge, etc., etc., etc. This is for the ghosts who feel they were born invisible to life, born into a war zone of poverty and desperation, and, or as I am in a neglect in a country which glamorizes violence, worships serial killers, threatens by massacre, and then arrogantly brags about gangbanging the whole fucking world. It's for the lovers, for the lovers of forgetfulness. And oh, I would, these are not my ghosts, but they fucking haunt me.